I was brought back into the hospital and I was admitted into the emergency room. After I was out of the hospital, um, through all my, I had to do um, physical rehab, I had to do occupational therapy, um, and I had to have many, many follow-up blood exams, MRIs, things like that. My bills were over $500,000. It took me a very long time to pay off all my bills. I was out of work for about nine weeks, and unfortunately, I had to fight very, very hard for my short-term disability. 180 million Americans today have health insurance through their employer. Today, those benefits that you get are non-taxable to you, as you know. John McCain's plan is they become taxable to you. The average cost of health care per family is $12,000. So the $5,000 per family isn't going to do you much. And what's very, more dangerous about it is that if you have a pre-existing condition or you're older, any insurance pool has the right to reject you. So it's not that the doctors in uh, taking care of it, they recommend you go to a hospital and that's how the hospitals get paid. They got to offer you uh, a procedure, then they get paid. We have got to change that. We've got to reward doctors that they have to go back for patient care. Drugs in Canada for the identical drug are 80% cheaper. Barack Obama will change that. He will allow for the importation of drugs as long as the safety issue is dealt with, he will allow those drugs to be brought into this country. Second, our federal government, which is the largest purchaser of drugs, cannot negotiate prices today. If you're buying $50 billion worth of certain drug through Medicaid, Medicare, and other programs, guess what? We're going to offer you $35 billion. You think the company's going to take it? You bet they are. I think his health care plan just, it makes sense to me. It's, um, and it's obvious. It's obvious that the, everything gets higher and higher and coverage is less and less. And you know, the deductibles and our co-pays and all of that, that doesn't go towards getting better, better um, care. The last big thing that he offers on his health care is what he calls his insurance exchange, where the people who don't have insurance have the ability to get into this insurance exchange, and there will be a threshold that there has to be in order for these health care providers to get into the insurance exchange and provide health care, and then once you are in that system, you can then go apply in the system and you have to meet thresholds too. Then you get in and they will bid on your health insurance to provide. His goal is that every single American be covered. Uh, and Wall Street Journal had a great piece the other day, I don't know if you read it, the Wall Street Journal, which is not exactly a bastion of liberal <laughs> press, uh, said McCain's plan is uh, by far the worst, Obama's is by far the best. And because of the savings that Obama is talking about and looking at the whole system, they figure that small businesses would save about uh, anywhere from 140 to 148 billion dollars a year and it could lead to 10 million new jobs. I just feel that he has a passion and a love for this country and for what he does that is so new um, and I trust him. I trust that he will really change things for the better. Um, we're in a really tough time right now so I trust that he will lead us in the right direction.